Welcome back to a new video ladies and gentlemen. As you guys can see today, it is another sit down video. I am just going to close off a chapter in my life. I know I did not start that with you guys, but I think it is vital that we close it off because you guys got to see the last bits of the chapter, which is my previous vlogs. And honestly, I wish i started this channel sooner because i feel like before covid and before a lot of changes like there was a lot that you guys could have taken away from that whole experience now i can't really go back i don't have footage i don't have anything that can take us back and reference a few things i'm very sad about that but i just feel like i'm just going to sit down today and just talk to you guys a little bit and express some of the, my thoughts you know what i mean um my experience all in all so i'm just gonna point out a few things i'm somebody who grew up watching movies like for the entertainment value and then when you study the history of where everything actually began how in each and every different era you get different filmmakers there were filmmakers who would use film and cinemas as an escape from the reality because it was too much and as the time progresses you get filmmakers who later on were against that and said no we're gonna face the problem head on that kind of shifted my mindset in a sense that okay you can say i'm just here for the entertainment value but there's so much problems in the world if you utilize like that education the right way you can actually help people um in a way you know what i mean and obviously i know you can choose the type of content you want to create you have a right to create what you want to create but i felt like oh my gosh this is actually bigger than what i thought it is that was a really huge eye opener so obviously when it comes to entertainment to art and all of that you know people always have their opinions some people might be happy with your work some people might not again to each their own so your work is basically based on <sighs> Well, it's not based on, but criticism is bound to come with it. You know what I mean? People have their preferences, they have what they like, they have what they do not like. You know what I mean? And obviously, you can't please everyone. So, with going to school, the structures, techniques, methods in which we approach certain things. And through that, you are able to criticize other people's work. And if you get criticized yourself, you don't really get touched or anything like that because you can also see, oh, okay, I see why this was not right and this is right. In a sense, the constructive criticism is just a way for you to grow and it, it makes you realize, oh, okay, where can I better myself the next time rather than you taking it personally? Because sometimes people don't always like to hear the truth. You need to be always open to that and so it, it was just more of a reiteration another thing that was a huge shocker to me is working with what you have you know what i mean and i did producing and there was one lesson where because you know the producer is part of the people who get the funding planning the planning process basically and so there was a lesson where it was like the little that you have if you can make something out of it then you're on the right path to not go over the budget because there are a lot of people who have invested in the project you know what i mean the last lesson that i also took away from this whole experience is that story is everything to like personal now we are talking from my personal perspective there's a lot of things that you need to consider you need to consider the format is it like a one minute a feature film or you consider whatever structure you're going to use you know what i mean is it relevant even to south africa there's a lot it's a lot guys it's a lot and at the end of the day you want to make revenue things like that so now i'm going to just answer or not answer <laughs> so there are four um statements that i will be answering is it statements it's not question okay i think it's question okay, that i will be answering let's do that the biggest flop was in my first year <laughs> yeah guys so what happened was we recorded right we recorded the footage that we were supposed to record and submit you know what i mean and then somehow our footage got lost i don't think it was saved properly or something like that and then we panicked 
you know what I mean because we finished on time we were on time we just had to submit and do everything on time what we decided to do is that because one of the our group members had a camera we were like okay let's use your camera to reshoot sorry to reshoot <laughs> the the lost footage and then our lecture we let her know that when, when it was time you know to get our marks we told her that we recorded with our own camera and she was like that's cheating guys that is cheating <laughs> because you didn't use the equipment that was given to you guys so in a sense we cheated and I, at that moment i didn't get it like i think even our whole group we didn't understand Huru, what are you saying you know what i mean but now when i look back i'm like oh my gosh okay but at the same time it was like we came up with a plan we were trying to save ourselves we were trying to get marks <laughs> you know what i mean um but to her it was like no you guys cheated so ish guys that was that was a flop that i don't even Yo, that's the worst thing that can happen guys like let me tell you guys to lose footage that's the worst because after that i had this anxiety hey guys you know because in groups like era we rotate but that experience it was something else it was in my first year yeah it was a 30 second advertisement i think a lot of people enjoyed that project honestly speaking we did like a quarter it was like a quarter deluxe so what happened is that we bought a quarter right and then the quarter that we bought didn't really have enough you know it didn't even look appealing for the camera because you know when it comes to the camera it's a different story so we got help we bought extra fillings and we made it look nice and the camera captured it nicely and i think the cost was also nice it was so nice guys that was like my favorite this is definitely in our second year we did a television live production oh my gosh so it was like multiple cameras and i was in the middle i was the second camera and i remember how stressed i was like if they like okay zoom in zoom out you know and they edit in real time like in real time and we got marked on it i think that was the nicest like the nicest i'll miss the people for sure the people the most and also routine um knowing this is an assignment and you're gonna get mocked on it and you have to pass looking forward to that you know what I mean because now it's like okay in the real world obviously you can choose to do whatever you want you can work for a production you can create your own stuff you can do documentaries you can really do a lot actually you can go into marketing social media platforms uh, you know there's a lot you can do actually but now it's like now you're on your own fam like you not you don't have anything to look forward for, to in the sense that there's no routine there's no lecture you're trying to impress right now right now it's like the real world you know what i mean so i just think i miss that security blanket if i can put it that way that's the end of my video thank you for being here with me if you are still here and you're still watching this video thank you so much for being here with me and watching my videos being active if you're following on in me on instagram thank you so much if you haven't please do so because i want to interact with you guys if there's any thoughts you would like to share or any questions please do not be afraid to share in the comment section and please do subscribe to my videos if you do like it give this view Give this video a huge thumbs up i would really appreciate it please do subscribe hit the notification bell for every time that i do post for those who already has done all of these amazing things thank you so much i really do appreciate you guys i'll see you guys next time cheers guysies <laughs>